And it's Mardi Gras is the worst Mardi Gras since before it happened. And before the Mardi Gras happened, it was just a whole lot of cop kicking the heads in of gaming. So, <laughs> so, so this is pretty fucking low, man. <laughs> gaming or gaming? There's a bloke called Reginald Gaiman. <laughs> Yeah. And they'd every fucking, oh, every oh, night, oh, every every year on this date, they used to go around to his house and go, Oi, Reggie! And he, goes, Reggie go. and he went, what? <laughs> We're gonna kick your head. And he was like, oh, yeah, fucking fair enough. <laughs> and they proceeded, to, they proceeded to kick the fucking guy's head in. <laughs> Welcome back to the fastest growing YouTube channel. I wonder if you know that I know he's lying right now. Uh, so today, this is my apartment by the way. Nice little apartment, you know what I'm saying? Um, and these are our views. Views from the six. Uh, that's usually where I do my team. Today, 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 we are going apartment hunting. Yes. Yeah, so get along for the ride. I forgot my keys. I always f***ing forget something. Eh? That's the issue. All the time. Every time I go to leave the house, I forget something. Um, okay, keys, keys, keys. A few moments later. Yes! 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 Here we are. This is such a vlog camera shot. So, hey, hi, I'm a vlogger, yeah. That's who we're gonna pick up now. Okay, he's one of my best mates, and he's gonna help us check out this new apartment. This is my bad boy. Oh. I don't have a push to start button, unfortunately. But we actually getting it. So let's do this. I'll see you in the next shot. Just down this alleyway, and he's not outside. I didn't even know his place had a number. 227, huh? Bo is never on time. This guy's always late. And we were meant to be there at 9.35. And what's the time now? How long does it take to get there? About 26 minutes. And I think it's finally coming. Is that him? Is he coming? He's made it. How are you, mate? Feeling Soviet. Feeling... Oh, hey! Who put that window there, baby? <laughs> All right. Why does it smell like yogurt? We have missed the inspection. 
we have missed the inspection. We can't get in the inspection. Well, I guess we just get some food now. Did you see that? Did I get slot? This is a bartender's table. Are you on a drink? Yeah. So this is that ice hockey. Alright, so what are we getting? What are you getting? Uh, I'm gonna get the class. Classic stack. Fun water. Oh. It's not bacon. I'm gonna get the green and lean. Oh. When you're looking to inspect the place, make sure that you're there on time. They won't wait for you. Joys of being a normal person. Now listen up, you fuck a little f***ers. All got some fucking advice for you, what? Now I'll f***ing tell you this for free, what? Now firstly... What else is new? I don't know, dude. Oh, I was about to start a boring, like, conversation about work. Yeah, we'll start it. And you can upload whatever you want on any platform. These days, with like all the algorithms and everything and how the company is to advertisers, you can't do shit. You literally can't do much. What do you do kind of shit? Like in terms of doing like some big bang without investing a lot of money? Uh, there's ways. There's ways? Yeah. There's secrets. Yeah, that's the nature of being a sniper and being secretive, is that you have an ace in a hole always. Mm. Always. Mm. I'm interested on this ace. But Did you take a look at the movie Business Plan that I sent you? Yes. Yes. I had a very good look. No, did you actually get it or no? Oh no, I got it. Oh, you oh, got it? I'm, oh, I forgot to tell you. So, I'm planning, if all goes according to plan, to publish my first ever piece of published research in the next fortnight. In the next fortnight? Yep. Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean your first like, piece it's, of research? It's not like anything spectacular. So, you like a report just condensed into a smaller form. Yeah. So, what is money laundering? How does it take place in the art industry? Ah, uh, okay. And about the, the Hain Royal Commission. Wait, what was the conclusion of the study? Well, the, the conclusion of my dissertation was that I explicitly, not explicitly, I, without breaking any defamation laws, I accuse a company of being art money laundering. Accused of what? Being art money laundering. Art money laundering. Yeah. So basically, what I say is they're an online. Why did, you, why did you put your suit in here and take the cup out? Well, for dramatic effect. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So basically, I say to them, I say like, um, there's this company, and they sell hundreds upon hundreds of artworks every day. What's the company's name? Can't say. But okay, it's, we're gonna use this footage for. Okay, sure. All right. Now we are gonna use this footage. But if you're paying attention, you'll know which company it is. Okay. So. This company sells hundreds of artworks per day online. Okay. And a big problem in the art industry is this thing called authentication. Okay. So, let's say that you've got an artwork and you're told that it's a Picasso. Yeah. How do you know it's a Picasso? This company checks it out and tells you that it's a Picasso. Exactly. But the problem with that is there was a case in Melbourne where there was this guy that was forging paintings, yeah. and it was really obvious that he was forging paintings. Is this a so there was this case four years ago, Melbourne. This guy was forging paintings on a mass scale. Again, it's a big key. And I'm not sure if he went to jail. I think he, yeah, I think he went to jail for it. Basically, 
the judge, even though he had this operation where he had the original and then hundreds of people repainting it, yeah. even then the judge says, oh, it's really hard to prove that he's forging artworks. So what that means is even when you have irrefutable evidence that something's not authentic, it's still really hard to authenticate an artwork. It can take months. Yeah. And you need someone that's so specifically specialized in that field. Yeah. So this company that's authenticating artworks does it within two days, which is impossible because there's no one that talented enough, no one that would do it for free as well, because they say they do it for free. Um, they do it for free as well? Well, actually, sorry, no, I should, <laughs> I should correct that by saying we don't know whether they do it for free, whether they get paid thousands of dollars, which is a terrible business model, to do it in two days. But they said no, it's a pretty good business model if you're getting paid thousands of dollars for two days' work. But it's two days' work, it's three months' work done in two days. Yeah, so but it's a good business model. Well, I mean, <laughs> you're it, making a shitload of money, but it's not possible. But it's like, illegal. It yeah, it's like, is what you're saying. Yeah, think about something that takes you three months of work to yeah. do, and yeah. then being told to do it in two days. You're not going to do it properly. You're just going to be like, oh, there it is. There's there's a piece of shit. Yeah. But what's happening is, why can't we do a documentary on this? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Let's do a documentary. We'll fly to Melbourne or we'll interview people of the company and everything and we'll come to a conclusion, a resound conclusion, to either prove or disprove this okay. research. Tell you what, let's check out the defamation laws because I'd like to name this company and we can call it Investigative of Journalism. Interesting little revelations there. We actually will be doing this documentary, so that's why I kept this clip in there. Now, let's get back to the apartment hunting. So we're getting it installed. Yeah. Great to turn this way. Mm. You, but you just, you just don't have any idea when it's going to be installed yet? Uh, in the next week, or what week after. But depending, I need to rush to guy. Yeah. To come sooner. No, so this is my first one. Okay, so it's a 24 hour concierge. Um, yep. It's 24 hour, it's at the base of building A, it's building B. Yep. You got Google, Jim, so you got for like this, so you can show you those if you need to see them. Yeah. This one has a pretty cool rooftop garden barbecue area yep. as well. And um, I don't know, it's one parking, storage cage, and then the. Oh, it's got storage as well? Yeah, it does have storage. Yeah. Okay, so it's cool. Uh, apart from that, a lot of people have told me from the other years they've checked out that this one has that one more little storage cupboard. There is. For the others. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Right? It does, I guess. And this owner has included a lot of coin. The Lord Green. <laughs> the Lord Green. Can we get rid of the microwave? <laughs> it's on the outside. Yeah. I'd love to have that one there and have that roof as like a party thing and then get like kicked out of the house because someone like. I think people are They have this rooftop yeah. and it's it's mad. You see the whole city and everything and it's. Yeah, places to sit and shit. This is cool, there's an ensuite. I actually like this place though. Uh -huh. What do you guys reckon? Let me know. I gotta show off because there's more uh, people coming now. So let me go let me know what you guys think. There's also a bathroom in here. First thing to check. Hot water test. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. I did more shower te pressure test. One, two, three, four, Wait, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, yeah. Whoa, that's dope. You can't get this anywhere. Else. That's killer. <laughs> oh man. And there's the old city, eh? 
That is Spider-Man. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I'll be on the top. I'll just go down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, let's do this. Oh. Huh? Get the hot cha cha, baby. Oh, yeah, shit. Oh, oh five star Uber. Oh, That's what I'm talking oh, about, my man. Thank you very Later, much. Later, brother. I hate when the mic doesn't go on. I'm gonna check it out. There's a lot of people out here. So we got the police right there and we just drinking. It's Mardi Gras in Sydney. I know what's going on bro. Barely can just barely can just drink on Mardi Gras. And that's how it works in Sydney. Bro! Yeah. Fucking this Mardi Gras is the worst Mardi Gras since before it happened. And before the Mardi Gras happened, it was just a whole lot of cop kicking the heads in of gaming. So, <laughs> so, so this is pretty fucking low, man. <laughs> gaming or gaming? There's a bloke called Reginald Gaiman, <laughs> and then every fucking every night, oh, every every year on this date, they used to go around to his house and go, "Oi, Reggie!" And he goes, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And he went, "What? <laughs> We're gonna kick your head!" And he's like, "Oh yeah, fucking fair enough." <laughs> and they proceeded to they proceeded to kick the fucking guy's head in. And then over years of Chi then over years of Chinese whispers. We're here in 2019, where it's turned into some fucking month for gay pride. But it was, it was, Wait, like, what? It was really, it was really, <laughs> just, it was really just the cops wanting to bash up some guy called Reggie Gaiman. <laughs> if only, if only they had, if they'd fix that faux pas from the start. Read your encyclopedias, boys and girls, because at the end there's a little treat for all of you. I read it up on the Alex Jones channel, I'll tell you what. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Before you guys go, thank you so much for getting this far um, on this vlog. I know it's different from the content that I've uploaded so far. If you enjoy it, smash a like and smash a subscribe. The ones of you that have done that, thank you so much. If you want me to continue doing more content like this, comment and like. Um, that's how I really know. Um, I don't really like this. That shows that more than half of you are watching and continue to watch, but haven't subscribed. So if you're coming back, be part of the gang. Gang, gang. Click that subscribe button. Thank you guys so much. Love you. Us. The way I told it, turned free the whole shit. Made a move this for life. You think, oh shit. Did it on my own, couldn't care what you all think. Now I want the throne and the chair, free a pole.